Yeah, this is Dave from CheapBooks.com playing World of Tanks. The tank I'm playing is the AMX 1375. It's a French Tier 7 light tank, and the map is El Halouf. I used to absolutely love this tank uh, until they made the changes with the raised hill. It was so much more fun before. Before, what would happen is everybody would line up on their side of the map, and they would snipe each other across the map. And uh, if you found a nice place to spot in the middle, you would get a lot of spotting damage. But then they changed the map, and nobody does... Nobody lines up on the edges anymore. They just... Everybody heads for the north-western uh, corner, and that's it. You know, they made the map a little bit too easy. So it looks like I'm trying to do some spotting over here. It doesn't look like it's working out. I do love these tanks. And you'll also notice that I don't have the camo paint on the tank uh, because uh, a year and a half had passed and the camouflage expired on all of my tanks. I only paid for the summer camo, so because it's a desert map, I didn't have it at the time that I... Uh, made this uh, video. So it looks like there's not going to be any spotting damage, which is unfortunate. Just to give you an idea of what used to happen is that along this ridge, well, you can't really tell, but like th there would be tanks lined up over there and over there and over there and over there all along over here. Everybody would be lined up and across there and they would shoot across at everybody on the other side. But like I said, it, that that doesn't happen anymore in this game. It's really sad. So obviously I've been spotted. It's possible that I might not have six cents on this tank. For people who say never to use auto-aim, like I said, it's absolutely stupid for people to say things like that. This is a perfect example of when you use auto-aim. <laughs> You know, you can, I don't think people can do this in the sharpshooter mode. Enemy armor is damaged. Enemy armor is damaged. We didn't penetrate their armor. Target unlocked. So I... is damaged. We can only talk locally. I think I got a couple shots in. Obviously, while you're reloading, you want to run as much as possible. You want to make it make it so that he has to turn as much as possible. Penetration. Enemy is hit. Enemy armor is destroyed. Now here's a point where you might want to reload. There's only two shells left. I probably should have reloaded. You'll notice that I stopped in order to improve the accuracy. Target lost. Target acquired. Drop hit. Penetration. Enemy vehicle destroyed. Enemy is hit. Very standard maneuver. Get behind them. Be aware that someone is shooting at me. Ready to fire. I do have three kills. All of which were, of course, SPGs. I kill SPGs all the time. For me, it's no big deal. Enemy armor is destroyed. 
It's possible I got hit by an ally. Yeah, an ally shot me. Uh, you can see that because I used the auto-aim and he became unspotted, my gun changed where it was aimed at. That's one of the disadvantages of using the auto-aim. Things like that can happen. And I have accidentally... I accidentally killed an ally once because of it. But basically what happened was it was me, the enemy, and an ally, all three of us side by side. And we, we had our tracks touching... We were, it was side touching side, touching side. And we, my ally and I were aiming our guns towards the tank between us. And I was using the auto-aim, but right when I fired, the enemy died. So because that happened, the auto-aim became unlocked, and the gun was no longer aimed at the enemy tank, and it shot my ally and killed my ally. So that can happen. It happened to me once. Uh, where the auto aim caused me to uh, kill an ally. Um, okay, so um, this is uh, the AMX 1375. <coughs> uh, it was one of my favorite tanks. You'll absolutely enjoy it. It's just like the AMX 1390. You're going to enjoy them both equally. Um, I have the AMX 1390 right now, and I have the Lorraine 40T also. I got five kills. The map was El Halouf. Uh, if you would like to join my clan, especially if you play light tanks, you're going to love playing in a platoon with me because I love playing with light tanks. Uh, my clan is CBKS. You're welcome to join or CBKS2. And if you like to play SPGs, uh, the clan is S CBSPG. If you have any questions or comments, please post below.